2024 was an absolute whirlwind. From the adrenaline pumping Olympics to elections that reshaped the world, it felt like history was being written in real time. But don't worry, mega project lovers, because today we're simplifying things and rolling out the red carpet for the most jaw dropping, record shattering, and straight up legendary projects that define the year. From gravity defining skyscrapers to long awaited breakthroughs, these are the 2024 mega projects that changed the game. For this video, we're looking at our nominees for the most expensive mega project, the craziest engineering feat, and the best sports venue. We'll break down what these projects are all about and the wild ideas that brought them to life. But as for the winner, that's on you. Hit the comments and let us know which one takes the top spot and what category you want to see next. All set? Let's get into it. It goes without saying that mega projects are expensive to build. But what engineers embarked on in 2024 put a new spin on the term breaking the bank. For this nomination, we're not just considering the price tags of the mega projects on our list, but also the roles they play in solving the needs of people's livelihood, promoting economic and social development, and maintaining the sustainable development of the economy, society, and ecology. So, with that said, from futuristic cities to insane transport solutions, and in no particular order, here are our nominees. Costing a whopping $35 billion, the first nominee is the new capital of Indonesia, Nusantara. Designed to replace Jakarta, which faces severe congestion, pollution, and sinking land, Nusantara is Indonesia's new capital, located in East Kalimantan on Borneo Island. Aimed to be a sustainable, futuristic smart city, Nusantara would incorporate amazing technologies like renewable energy, AI-driven infrastructure, and extensive green spaces. But while the new capital promises economic decentralization and urban innovation, its immense cost has done more harm than good, raising concerns over the national debt, inflation, and potential budget cuts to other sectors. Regardless, with a projected population of 1.9 million by 2045, Nusantara could redefine urban living, prioritizing eco-friendly technology, autonomous transportation, and climate resilience. With the Indonesian government already claiming an 80% completion of the first phase, only time will tell how important and expensive this project will become. But if you think Nusantara was expensive, just wait till you see the next project. Soaring past a whopping $100 billion, California's high-speed rail is one of America's most audacious infrastructure gambles. Designed to slash travel times between San Francisco and Los Angeles to under three hours with 200 plus miles per hour electric trains, it promises to redefine transportation in a state plagued by gridlocked highways and sky-high emissions. With a route that would zip through the Central Valley, linking cities like Fresno and Bakersfield, before stretching to coastal urban hubs, it promises to be powered by renewable energy. Nicknamed the Green Lifeline by supporters, it promises to ease climate pressures and spark an economic revival in overlooked regions. But here's the twist. Plagued by budget explosions, political feuds, and years of delays, critics argue the current focus on a 171-mile Central Valley segment risks becoming a train to nowhere without connections to major cities. Skeptics have had a field day blasting the cost, fearing cuts to education and healthcare, while boosters insist it's a long-term win for equity and sustainability. Regardless of where you stand, construction crawls forward, with the Central Valley stretch aiming to open by 2030. The question, however, is will the project become a global model for green transit, or a cautionary tale of throwing money into the wind? Only time, and taxpayer patience, of course, will tell. Costing a mind-boggling 35 billion euros, France's Grand Paris Express is rewriting the rulebook for urban transit. This megaproject, which, by the way, is Europe's largest metro expansion, aims to bury Paris's infamous traffic and inequality by connecting its long-neglected suburbs with 200 kilometers of new rails, 68 stations, and four fully automated lines. Designed as a metro for the people, it promises 15-minute sprints between suburbs and a greener, fairer future. The vision is a ring-shaped network circling Paris, linking business hubs, Olympic venues, 
and working class neighborhoods with driverless trains humming at 60 miles per hour. It plans to do all this with solar powered stations, bike highways, and even lush parks that would cement its eco-friendly cred while cutting car emissions by 25%. But as usual, there's a twist. Plagued by budget bloat rising from 19 billion euros and delays, critics call it a fiscal time bomb. Rising debts, construction snags, and pandemic chaos have pushed full completion all the way back to the 2030s, with some doubting its equity promises. Will it truly bridge Paris's stark rich-poor divide, or become a symbol of overreach? Only time will tell, but for now, 90% of tunneling is done, and some flashy stations are rising. The hope is that by 2030, 2 million daily riders could ditch their cars and hit the tracks. And that would be a sight to see. Moving on to our next category. Mega projects have always been known to make you question what is possible. But sometimes, engineers and architects decide to go a little beyond the blueprints that simply leave us speechless. Here are the nominees for projects in 2024 that did just that. Rising from the sands like a sci-fi manifesto, Neom isn't just a city. It's a 170-kilometer-long mirror slashed across the desert. Saudi Arabia's crown jewel, The Line, reimagines urban life as a Blade Runner-esque strip. Zero cars, zero streets, and a jaw-dropping vertical city encased in glass, where AI governs everything from hydroponic gardens to flying taxis. Moving on from the fact that doesn't sound like a disaster waiting to happen. If you think the plans for the line are insane, just hold on, because there's more. Neom's blueprint doesn't stop at the line, but also includes Trojena, a mountain resort with an artificial lake and ski slopes in 40 degrees Celsius heat. Oxagon, a floating industrial octagon run by robots, and Sindala, a luxury island where coral reefs merge with hypermodern architecture. It's essentially a climate-controlled bubble, promising 9 million neomads, a utopia of 100% renewable energy and AI-driven predictive living. But as with most projects, here's the twist. Critics call it a mega-project mirage. Skeptics slam its physics-defying scale, like building the length of the Florida Keys in a seismic zone. And its human cost, including displacing indigenous tribes, is just alarming, to say the least. Environmentalists even warn of shattered ecosystems, while engineers question if its liquid mirrors and underground hyperloops are even possible. Yet with the cranes already looming and Saudi's sovereign wealth fund pouring billions into drones and AI, Neom charges ahead. Will it become humanity's next urban evolution, or a folly etched in glass and hubris? Only the desert knows, and all we can do is scratch our heads at just how insane it all sounds. Moving on from the sci-fi to the reality, we have our next nominee. Soaring 722 feet above the Detroit River, this $5.7 billion cross-border titan isn't just a bridge, it's a steel and concrete symphony. Named after hockey's Mr. Elbows, its twin diamond-shaped towers slash the skyline, flanked by North America's longest cable-stayed spans and bike lanes suspended like adrenaline rings. With its 1.6-kilometer main span, this bridge is North America's longest cable-stayed bridge and is built to handle 30,000 vehicles daily. Built to outmuscle the crumbling Ambassador Bridge, it's engineered for 150 years of blizzards, gales, and endless 18-wheelers. Now let's zoom in on why it's an engineering flex. This bridge is a 2.5-kilometer cable-stayed colossus with six traffic lanes, bike paths, and pedestrian walkways. Flanked by twin ports of entry spanning the equivalent of 53 football fields. Construction took 1,200 workers, 25,000 tons of US and Canadian steel, and a two nation approach, jointly funded and managed to bolster $1 billion in daily cross border trades. Behind the scenes, the bridge anchors a $6.4 billion ecosystem, including highway upgrades and smart tech customs plazas with AI driven traffic systems. The goal of this bridge is to ease traffic on the busiest U.S.-Canada trade route by its 2025 opening. It ultimately aims to boost Midwest supply chains and create over 8,000 jobs, showing that infrastructure can strengthen both economies and diplomatic ties and leave us, well, as you can see, speechless. 
But if you think a bridge is crazy, wait till you hear of this mega city. Backed by Toyota and designed by architect Bjark Ingels, Woven City is a $10 billion prototype for tomorrow's urban life. Nestled near Mount Fuji, this 175-acre living laboratory reimagines cities with three types of streets, one for self-driving vehicles, one for pedestrians, and one for bikes and scooters, all interwoven like a circuit board. As if that's not mind-boggling enough, the city's carbon-negative buildings blend traditional Japanese timber with futuristic tech, including solar panels, hydrogen fuel cells, and rooftop gardens. It would even include AI-powered smart homes that monitor residents' health, manage waste, and even deploy robot assistants. But once again, that's not all, because this city might be the closest thing to a cyberpunk-inspired city we have in the works today. It'll be so advanced that underground tunnels will shuttle goods autonomously, while sensor-laden public spaces will optimize energy use in real time. Currently under construction, the city aims to house over 2,000 residents, mostly Toyota employees, retirees, and researchers, to test innovations like autonomous mobility, robotics, and renewable energy systems. With all the nominees in this category accounted for, it's time for the next category. Stadiums and sports centers have always been a staple of any large community. Just take a look at the Colosseum and you'll get the picture. But sometimes engineers go a little over the top and create sports venues that make us question everything. Sports centers like these. When you hear of the stadium, the first thing any football fan would think of is the home of Real Madrid. But for a mega project lover, there is a lot more to look at. Crowned by a futuristic retractable roof and wrapped in a shimmering steel and LED skin, the Santiago Bernabeu has managed to marry football heritage with sci-fi spectacle. Its 360-degree video scoreboard, suspended like a halo, beams replays to 85,000 fans, while a retractable pitch allows concerts or esports beneath the same roof. Underground, the stadium houses a sprawling mall, museum, and Michelin star dining that has quickly redefined match days. But if you don't want to go underground, the Skywalk offers vertigo-inducing views of Madrid and a 12,000-ton sliding pitch that rolls out for events. To put that in layman's terms, the pitch itself can be retracted and stored pristinely underground, turning the stadium into an event center in less time than you can ever imagine. In terms of sustainability, this stadium is packed with solar panels, rainwater recycling, and energy-efficient systems that slash its carbon footprint. Set for completion in 2025, this stadium of tomorrow aims to host year-round spectacles from UCL finals to VR gaming arenas and, of course, amazing concerts. If you think that's impressive, let's head over to France to look at something they built for the Olympics. Rising in the heart of Porte de la Chapelle, the Adidas Arena is a 200 million euro masterpiece that aims to redefine urban venues. With a sleek, angular design and a shimmering facade, this 8,000-seat arena was the crown jewel of Paris's 2024 Olympic legacy. Built for eSports, concerts, and elite sports, it features cutting-edge technologies like 360-degree LED screens, immersive sound systems, and retractable seating for maximum flexibility. In terms of sustainability, this arena was armed with solar panels, rainwater harvesting, and even geothermal heating to slash its carbon footprint, while green spaces and bike lanes connected to the city. After the Olympics, it's expected to host Paris's basketball games and global events, and is by far the true definition of a real game changer. Okay, putting this project into this category might be a controversial take, but just imagine watching an NBA game where the court seems to float in space, or a UFC match with an octagon surrounded by a 360-degree wave of stats, replays, and live athlete cams. That right there is the MSG Sphere, a $2.3 billion sports and entertainment revolution in Las Vegas. This glowing orb isn't just for concerts. Its 160,000 square foot LED dome, the largest screen in the world, wraps fans in stunning visuals. It's practically the same feeling as watching a Formula One race from the driver's seat or a tennis match with the ball zooming overhead. But that's not all, because this Sphere's 4D tech takes things further with rumbling haptic seats that react to tackles, 
temperature shifts that mimic the outdoors, and sounds so precise that you can hear sneaker squeaks from the highest seats. For leagues, it's a total game changer. Esports become life-size battles under the dome. Boxing and UFC fights feel like you're right at the cage side, with punches projected in slow motion across the massive space. All-star events turn halftime shows into VR experiences. But here's the twist. The sphere isn't replacing stadiums. It's redefining the sports experience. Want to feel like you're in the end zone for the Super Bowl with 18,600 fans around you? Done. Or watch the NHL draft, already booked for 2024, with prospects' highlights spinning overhead. Easy. Critics might call it overkill, but for fans seeking total immersion, it's a slam dunk. The Sphere isn't just a venue, it's the future of front row seats. And that's a wrap on the 2024 Mega Project Awards. From record-shattering budgets to engineering flexes that push the limits of reality, these projects define the year 2024 in the boldest way possible. But now, it's time for you to participate in this mega award ceremony. No pun intended. Who takes the crown? Hit the comments and let us know your winner for each category. And while you're at it, tell us what mega projects you're keeping an eye on for the year 2025. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the world's biggest, wildest buildings, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell so you never miss out on the next one. Until next time, keep dreaming big and building bigger.